As I stand here before you, I began to reminisce on the time when I did not have hope to keep going or the situations that left me in doubt or fear. Growing up, there was not much I would say because people thought I was an introvert. But really, I didn't think I would be heard if I spoke up or out about something. Have you ever felt like giving up or throwing in the towel? Well, I have felt those things at many points in my life. Growing up, I was always surrounded by people that supported and had faith in me to do great things in life. Yeah, the support was there, but there was also pressure because I didn't want to let the ones who were counting on me down. As life went on and I started high school, I began to see the impact life can have on someone's mental health. In high school, I started taking more accelerated classes that really required me to put my mind to work. And these classes took a toll when I started to, when I was afraid to ask for help. And I began to feel stuck in situations which could have been fixed if I just asked for help. As I began to struggle with these situations, I started to drown within my own thoughts and the world around me became colorless. But through it all, I kept a smile on my face. For as long as I can remember, the Boys of Yourself has always been a place of relief from the real world. In 2012, it was my first time ever walking through the doors of Tuck Hill Unit Boys of Girls Club. Now here we are, 12 years later, and I must say that that was one of the most best things I could have asked my parents to do. As I started to find my place and feel comfortable around the club, I started to learn about the programs that they offer to us one being the Youth the Year program. This program has allowed me to speak in front of many different audiences and network with others. I saw the faith and support everyone at the Boys and Girls Club had in me, and their support has shown me I am not alone. It's because of my club experience that I want to share my story with other youth that may be going through the same struggle and to show them to not be afraid. One important lesson that I will leave with you today is when you put your mind to something, the possibilities are endless to what you can achieve. This is me. I'm taking off the mask that once controlled me. I'm confident, secure, and full of self-love. I embrace my uniqueness, and I'm ready to accept change. My name is Faith Miller, future flight surgeon for the United States Air Force. And most importantly, future leader for the next generation of club kids. Thank you.